Hi, I hope you're well and that you've had a good rest and that you're having a good morning. It's about the second time I've tried to record this video, so hopefully I'll get through this time. Um, I wanted to come on and pray, um, just pray for the church and pray for um, for healing and those who are backslidden as well. So if you'll agree with me as we join together in prayer now. The Lord says, where two or three are gathered in my name, there I shall be. You know, there I will be in the midst of you. So let's pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. Lord, we pray, Lord, for the persecuted church. We pray, Lord God, for your bride. Lord, help us, Lord, we pray. And thank you for helping us, Lord. Thank you for helping, Lord God, those, all of us, Lord, as we face persecution in whatever way. We pray, Lord God, for you to Continue to strengthen us. Continue to protect us, Lord. Help us to persevere, Lord. And not give up. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you that you hear us when we pray, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. And pray, Lord God, for the bride. You know who are yours, Lord. And I just invoke the holy, precious blood of Jesus Christ upon them, upon every, all of us, Lord, uh, who are yours, you know, who are truly yours. In Jesus' name, help us, Lord, to be strong in you, drawing our strength from you, Lord, as we face persecution, Lord, in whatever way that may come. Because we know, Lord God, that many other trials are the righteous, of the righteous, but the Lord delivers us from them all. You say to rejoice, Lord, because your mark is upon us when we go through all these trials and tribulations, Lord. Help us, O oh God. Help us, Lord, to rejoice in your ways, no matter what. Help us to rejoice in you, Lord. Help us to be strong, Lord. Help us, Lord. Silence lying tongues, Lord. Deliver us from the snare of the fowl, like the snare of the enemy. The evil one, Lord. Thank you, Lord, for vindicating us. Thank you, Lord, for justice, preservation and protection. Thank you for your grace and mercy, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for your grace and mercy. Thank you, Lord. I pray, Lord, for those who are backslidden, Lord, that you will touch their hearts to return to you, O oh God. We've all been there at some point, Lord. We've all done it, Lord. I pray you would help us to, um, those who are backslidden, Lord, to return to you. Convict their hearts, Lord. I pray, Lord God, for mercy for them. And that you would extend your hand to help them as they repent. And stop what they're doing, Lord. Completely stop what they're doing. What they're doing, that's not our view, Lord. And I pray, Lord God, for all those that need healing, Lord. You know you know everything, Lord. I pray, uh, thank you, Lord, that right now, Lord, you're healing. You're already healing the sick, Lord. You're already healing the sick. You're already healing them, Lord. So I just thank you. We thank you for healing, Lord. Healing and restoration. We pray, Lord God, and we pray for mercy, Lord. For those who are backslidden, Lord. I know I've already just prayed this, but I just want to pray this one more time. I just pray for mercy that you would extend your hand to help them, Lord, as they repent. And convict their hearts, Lord, to come before you. And um, just to rend their hearts before you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, Lord, that you hear us when we pray. Pray, Lord God, thank you. Thank you, Lord. I pray for healing, Lord. I pray for the healing for um, from trauma. I pray for healing for children, Lord. Just all those that need your touch from Lord right now. They, those that need a touch from you who are mentally ill, who are physically ill. Lord, I pray for them. I pray you would heal them and restore them. I pray you would comfort their hearts, Lord. I pray you would heal them, oh God. All those that need a touch from you, oh God. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, that you hear us when we pray. Thank you, Lord, that you've answered us. Thank you that you've answered our prayers, Lord. Thank you, Lord. 
I'm so grateful for your mercy, Lord. We are so grateful for your mercy. Thank you, Jesus. We're so grateful for your mercy, Lord. In Jesus' name. And I just want to pray um, any evil arrows that are sent out, any evil arrows that have been sent out to myself, my family, anything concerning me, my ministry, and those who are in the body of Christ, who are uh, doing the work of the Lord. We just reverse those evil arrows back to sender in the name of Jesus Christ and cancel them. We rebuke them in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the blood of Jesus. They're cancelled and anointed now. In the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. There's power in the blood of Jesus and there's power in the power of Je in, in the power of the name of Jesus. There is power in his name. Name of all names. Thank you, Lord. We just thank you for reversing those evil arrows back to sender that they're anointed and cancelled now, Lord. According to your word, Lord God, thank you. You say no weapon that's formed against us shall prosper. Your children, Lord. And every tongue that rises against us in judgment shall be shown to be in the mark. You say we shall not be afraid of the arrow that flies by day. Lord God, we thank you. We thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We thank you that the things that are sent out to us from afar will not alight upon us, O oh God. Because of your mighty, holy, outstretched arm, your mighty holy, outstretched arm, powerful and mighty and supreme and matchless, Lord, you are. And we thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Jesus. And we thank you in Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen.